What is up YouTube and welcome back to some more of the Let's Fight series where we will be playing a game that came out on July 7th, 1993 known as Samurai Spirits in Japan. Samurai Showdown. So we played with 11 characters. It's crazy. Um, yeah, and now we're gonna do the twelfth and final one. I don't think it's gonna take that long because she's pretty good. I believe. It's weird to say that uh, not having played her, but I mean I've beat her eleven times. Like I said, counts for some intel or whatever. But yeah, let's do it. We can finally check out her alternate costume, Nakaruru. Oh yeah, I think I've seen that before, or on one of one of her later installments or something. I think the hawk changed color too. I like that that color for that. Probably has a name, but uh, maybe we can find out here. Let's see what we got. So Anu Mutsube, Leila Mutsube. Some this must be like her weird dashes. Got a backwards shirt. Or wait. No, it's not backwards short you can. That's um I don't even know what those are called. That that's a weird input. But you start at the left and then go to down. It's like a reverse quarter circle backward, I guess, maybe. Um then we got the backward plus C or a half circle back. Um I've circled back again. So that's well unarmed, possible well unarmed. Okay. Oh yeah, that's the bird's name. Mama ha ha. Remember seeing that before? I'm like, is that really a bird name? Backward C. So we got half circle back, backward, the other backward thing, and quarter circle forward. Let's see if I we can get them all. Oh, so that's the same move. I did, I did not even know that. Interesting. And then what's this gonna do? Oh, okay. That's like the full screen. Not stopping for anything. <laughs> oh yeah, this is gonna be great. We only have done one move so far. <laughs> Not counting normals. One special move, I should say. Ooh. It's not going to be easy for you. Hmm. Of course we die from a butt attack. Uh, sorry, brief interruption. And we're back. Uh, let me look at these again real quick. Okay. That's a really interesting move. That's the crouching heavy slash. Hmm. And sometimes when I do the heavy slash, she goes flying. Hmm. I think it. Oh, okay. So you have to do a half circle to stay grounded. That's interesting. I didn't know they had a character with um. It's always like a tricky, subtle thing when there's a character who has two special moves. One is like quarter circle forward, another one is half circle forward. Um, because like that's pretty easy to get an input error getting one or the other. AKA Dalton and Street Fighter 2. Um, 
but I think it's I think it's cool. I think it's actually good to do that, honestly, because like it just um, rewards players for being more technically proficient. It's a really nerdy way to put it, but whatever. Whatever, man. So what's the standing heavy slash? Like an it looks like it would be a crouching. It's such an anti-air move. I mean, I guess we're not supposed to be like a brawler with this little girl and her bird. I guess this should suit my strategy pretty well. With some paper. I really don't know what to do when the dude's like right in front of me though. <laughs> it's kinda awkward. I guess I'll do that. Oh, okay. So all all three of them, there's like three that go on the ground and three that go in the air. And the air ones are the quarter circle. Um no, it's not. It's not half circle for it. That's the. That's the um, reverse, backwards thing. Okay, so I'll I'll, I'll explain this because I'm kind of just talking to myself. Some of you guys are probably confused. So. Um, the top one is where she stays on the ground. I thought it was half circle forward, but it's not. And then that one. The second one, Layla Motsube, is when she goes in the air. Half circle backward. Okay. Yeah, this is a really cool character. It's no wonder she's uh, become like a staple of the series. Also, that was good. I didn't realize that move had a second hit. So you want to get really close if you're going to be close. But um, yeah, I don't know if it's official um, lore or not or something, but like, I know they say like, it's how Maru and Nakaruru is like basically like kind of a Ryu and Ken situation. Uh, for lack of a better comparison. Because Nakaruru and Ken are very different. <laughs> uh, Ryu and Hamaru, not as different. Definitely not as different. Uh, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like Street Fighter a lot. Street Fighter V, um, the final balance patch came out not so long ago. That's really good. I think they did a great job. Honestly. Can't wait to play more Oro and Nikali. Both look a bit better now, I believe. And most of all with Oro, the V-Trigger 1. Which myself, as a one who does not enjoy combos, particularly of the long variety, Yeah, this is a good warm up. <laughs> Gotta try her other moves real quick before I start trying to win or something. I guess I might as well try to win. Um, I'm a little bit, um, you know, like I'm a little bit burnt out from playing this game so much, obviously, but like, um, I'm gonna miss playing it. I'm excited to play Sam Show 2 at some point because that's like a very similar game. Maybe same engine? Question mark. It looks like it, um, or something. But like, I am excited to play other games too because like a big part of this series obviously is to play a lot of fighting games. And um, 
the next one, I'm, I'm, I've already decided it because I think I might record some tonight. I was doing some research. Um, it's the most modern one yet, so that's kind of cool. Doesn't say that much since all three of them are kind of old. Uh, Guilty Gear's not that old though. That was well after this and Street Fighter 2. Good, like, four or five years? I don't know. I don't know all the dates. I, I've never been a huge, like, knowing dates of things kind of person. Some people, it's like, it's like that one guy likes movies, one guy likes albums. Like, they know, like, all the dates for their respective, like, thing they like. Um, and, like, there are some video game dates I know, but, like, it's, like, not many at all compared to my like passion for it I don't know <laughs> it's just kind of interests me because my brain has just like never like been interested in that and so I'm interested in things that are not interesting to me and the way I can learn more about them is from people who are interested in them so Sorry if that doesn't make sense, you guys can run that back if you want, but... <laughs> also, I didn't notice her skin color was different too with this skin, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I don't feel it's consistent with her sprite and the windscreen, but I digress. Oh my gosh, I sliced it in both. Sorry, Poppy. And again. Man, this fight is gonna be brutal. Uh, okay, so the half circle back is the bird. Yeah, dude. You don't stand a chance. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, mate. Mostly just because of your doggo. I mean, I'm sorry because of the dog. That's not like why he's not gonna win. You guys know what I'm talking about. You know I'm a huge Poppy fan. Or if you didn't know, then now you do. Alright, so I'm trying to make it come back. No thanks. No thank you on that. I'm just gonna move right along. take those. <laughs> I don't know what that bird was doing. That was cool. That was cool too. Oh, it's just so unfair. Alright, no, that's good. to do it to him. <laughs> I'm gonna go on a limb here and say Nakaruru is probably top tier in this game. I'm trying to think, like, who might be better? I don't, I don't know. I really couldn't even tell you. <laughs> Other than Hamakusa, but that doesn't count because he's not playable. <laughs> I want to say someone. I think Ganon might be up there too, but like, it's one of those characters, like, he, I feel like he could maybe even be trash, just because he's so weird, so. Oh wait, Ukyo. I, I totally forgot about him. I was looking like, it was the last spot I looked, I was looking clockwise from Haomaru, but uh, <laughs> yeah, he is up there. I do know that. Interesting. <laughs> I 
Okay, that crouching heavy slash is pretty janky. Just just throwing it out there. A little bit of a harsh word to use. But I've put a lot of hours into this game, so it doesn't give me a right to be mean, but it does mean that I've observed it a lot. And anybody who's watched all of my videos of Samurai Showdown, one, thank you very much for the support. And two, you will know what I'm talking about. <laughs> But then you also know, like, it's been, like, n essentially nothing, like, laggy or janky. Um, like, definitely less than, like, 0.1% of the moments or whatever. You know, like, this is this game's a masterpiece. Um, I hope that much is obvious <laughs> to all of y'all. Started a great series. Just like, uh, I was trying to think of the right way to say this. Just like Street Fighter 1 and especially Street Fighter 2 did <laughs> for, um, for that series. I do look forward to playing through Street Fighter 1 at some point, though. Not sure when that will be. Or Street Fighter, you know. But if I just say that, that doesn't usually bring to mind that classic game. <laughs> Depends on the, um, the audience. Alright, time to stop talking for a moment. It's over. Oh, it's over for me. <laughs> totally jinxed it. No, but no worries though. <coughs> that was a good uh, slide or whatever. Yeah, I gotta be ready for the keep the crouching guard on lock because I don't even know if there's an overhead in this game. I feel like there's gotta be, but um, not counting aerial attacks. Um. Yeah, so I was gonna say I gotta keep my crouching guard ready. I know there's universal overhead later in the series. Um, yeah, it's just the kicks and the slashes in this. I don't know. There's uh, a lot more to fighting games than the controls or even the guide indicate. <laughs> Something you kind of start to realize after a while. Alright, this guy's being pretty good. Pretty, uh, Hamaru like gameplay. Gotta commend the AI here. That was dope. Makes you wonder if like the Halmaru AI versus Nakaruru is any different from any of the other ones, or if like like how much um, detail went into like all the AI interface. That's always been one of the most like interesting and like for me like mysterious parts of fighting game design because I just like don't have the information, so it's a mystery. Yeah, close battles. This guy's like copying me. Mmm, nice. Heavy slash, he's definitely copying me. Alright, I think this charade has gone on long enough though. Okay. 
Wow. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Except that his grabs are sick. And I feel like this is the first time I've seen Hamaru use grabs. <laughs> like <laughs> another another reason for that AI is different against different characters theory. I'm in such a conspiracy theory mood, I was watching Joe Rogan today. I like some of his content. <laughs> There's some of it I really like actually. So shout out Joe Rogan. <laughs> My only critique, you gotta have more video game people. <laughs> yep, that's it. Reggie, former president of Nintendo of America. That's my formal request. I hope somebody watch it, watching this can spread the message. Or uh, pass the message along, I guess. <laughs> also, wow. This bot is trolling me. Okay, man. Ah, oh, that heavy slash. Now I see the problem. I try to get close to heavy slash, and I get grabbed. Use more special moves is the solution. don't usually get to practice my half circle backwards inputs. What would it be? Half, half quartal... Oh my god, I cannot talk today. Half circle backwards is... <laughs> I just had to say that. That was for the fighting game culture. You're welcome. You know you're doing an input pretty slowly when you can like just look at the character on the screen and tell what input the person is putting in. <laughs> Lol. Okay, man. Good gameplay. I'm not gonna lie. Guess this is the first opponent who's presenting a bit of a challenge this run. for a lot of grabs. That is definitely the case. <laughs> Noted. Been playing the game so long that how Mara is starting to act like Amakusa. The game just is uh <laughs> it's trying its hardest. Has learned too much about me. <laughs> the learning AI. It's like one of those amiibos. <laughs> I don't understand how that works at all, but apparently they do learn. Or so I've been told. <laughs> yeah, screw you and your tornadoes, dude. Nope, you can't do that. <laughs> uh, so this is how it's supposed to go. Apparently that is true. Mm. <laughs> Alright, this bird is MVP. 
literally did more damage than me this round, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I still won the first round. <laughs> Undisputable fact. enough to justify it um, forfeiting this round. Mm, maybe not. The dream's still alive. I hate uh, Nakaru's heavy slashes. I'm sorry, SNK, but it's true. It worked out good. Not bad. Get me out of here. Oh, wrong one. That's not good. Can you back up, please? GG. That was a GG. <laughs> Alright, pretty close. ones. The heavy slash one covers more range than it looks like though. Probably medium is best. It's the only time you really need the heavy slash one it seems like. Like, I don't get a strong punish. It's kind of a problem. I mean, I guess she's not supposed to have that, but like... It's really... <laughs> different from the usual... Samurai Shodan character formula, you could say. But again, it's probably part of why she's like... A really iconic character in the series. Nice. I'm more of a Haomaru player, I can definitely tell that much, but... I don't know. I might not even be right. I haven't played her enough to be sure about that. One of the characters I'm most interested in, though, in the, that I've played in this game, I will say that. The Ryu characters are always interesting, like the, the protagonists or whatever. I feel like that's kind of a given, I mean, in like a well-designed fighting game. 
here's one for you guys dive kick <laughs> that is the name of a video game for those who do not know so check it out Yeah, the bird does not help in cross-up situations. I really needed it there. It's just that thing of, uh... Don't have enough time to do the inputs because he's applying pressure pretty consistently. As he should be. Ooh, come on, dude. Not even worth it. I gotta start using medium slash after I land a jump in because that has happened so many times already. One more of these gonna do the trick. We will never know. <laughs> the chip damage was not enough. <laughs> The bird angles are really good. I, I like that move a lot. They're very, very good. Oh yeah. And that's the key to beating this opponent. I'm getting this sense. I mean, I'm just not good at using her, uh, her dash moves. There's a one good use. <laughs> Might be my first one this whole run. <laughs> Might be worth a trade, I don't even know. Looks like it is time to bid you goodbye for now, my friend. Unless I choke. Yep, it's happening. Awesome. Yeah, that was that was just the kind of content I strive to create here. <laughs> Ch 
cooking. No drink or food necessary. <laughs> That was one of her strengths as well. too overconfident but I feel like this is like just a matchup thing I mean I guess we'll see with how I do against other people but like that's just my that's just the feeling I'm getting is the turmoil that uh, <laughs> is part of the <this> series. <laughs> uh, I wasn't even sure what that sentence was. It's part of the fun game experience. There we go. cornered is as well. Nice. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Definitely let the bird get the round win every time. Every time. Mama haha. -ha. Did not forget the bird's name. Oh, so he got a stun. Amazing. Amazing gameplay. And, um, it's honestly really innovative and cool, um, that the bird projectile has like a cooldown timer since the bird has to fly back. Very innovative and cool for the time this fighting game came out. That's my favorite move. And that's why we won two Vs. Oh, so her win pose is the coolest animation she has. IMO. Against my Hokkaido hurricane attack, you didn't have a chance. More like against my bird. Alright, let's slice these. It's like this move was like made for this game. Literally. Oh yeah. Alright. Will we struggle as much against the next opponent? Now that I know who it is, definitely a strong maybe. Hopefully not. <laughs> Oh yeah, I know some of your tactics. And I hate some of them, including this move. So, go for a lot of grabs might not have been just how Mario, unfortunately. There is still some hope. Hmm. Alright. This is a good round. I mean, it, it wasn't really a good round because he hit me with a lot of those, but it was a close round. Yeah, the I've said I already said this a bunch of times. So I'm only gonna say it once, but there is a reason um, those kind of grabs are no longer in fighting games. Ooh, that was good. all about the bird. Aw, oh, dang it. Of course he doesn't want to back off. Quite a finisher. 
At least it wasn't the other grab. Well, based on those two rounds, it's not going to be as hard as Haomaru, but it is not guaranteed. I was going to maybe do this in... try to go in one video, just go for a super long one, but now that I'm struggling a bit more than I thought, I'll probably break into at least two. This one and the grand finale, I suspect. Maybe three. You never know what's going to happen with Amakusa. You never know. Final Amakusa showdown. I'm glad I have this bird to help me with it. Or, or, I'm glad I will have this bird to help me with it. A little more accurate. Wrong uh, choice move there. Should have done the close one. I like the crouching every slash in to jump at least, that's pretty smooth. All the fires are out of the way. Really good pressure, not gonna lie. What are you doing, mate? That is so weird. I would have read a Blanca ball and with the bird that would have been sick. I think I was uh, being a little too patient there or something. <laughs> More attacking, less patience. Cloud. Must be some invincibility frames on that heavy slash. Crouching heavy slash. So that beats that move, that's cool. And there's a good thing to do when that happens. I may have to end this episode after this because I feel like I need a break or something. <laughs> I think I'm getting back warmed up into the let's fight mind after playing all those racing games. A lot more chill. I'm excited to finish Excite Truck and uh, do Excite Bots. I already own a copy. Oh my god, dude. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have some dinner too. So I will conclude this episode after this. Probably gonna be a three part thing, it seems.
Yeah, I can't quite like pin down a strategy with Nakaruru. I think I think that's the part I'm most rusty on. Like, because like another way, and like I've said something kind of similar to this before, I think, but um. Like another way to look at um, like a fighting game character select screen, it's like yeah, there's like 12 characters, um, but like each character is sort of a puzzle because it's like I'm I booted up the game, I'm playing as Nakaruru, and it's like there are a lot of moves. There's a lot of like. Um, a lot of moves, a lot of things to account for, just about like the entire experience of playing as this character. And then so it's like, how do I do this most optimally, right? That's the most brief way it can be summarized, but like, because for most characters, I think it's fair to say for well-designed characters, it's like you have to use every move. Um, there's like a situation in which each move is most optimal or whatever. In terms of frame data, that's like, that's about as technical as it gets. <laughs> you know, but like, that's like a part of being fighting game. Ooh, oh my god. Yeah, I really can't talk today. That is a part of being good at fighting games that like not a lot of people like think about or understand or anything. Um, but. Obviously, like, people who are, like, huge fanatics, like me, like, eventually come to some similar conclusion. Or so I believe, but, like, I haven't really heard a lot of, uh, others say that. I was so freaking distracted, but it's okay, because that was an important, relevant topic, obviously. Screw your Blanca balls. Slaughterhouse something. Oh my god, dude. It's just like I said after my first round against him where I almost won both rounds. It did not seem hard, but also it was not guaranteed that that was true, or something to that effect. I'm just imagining it, or is he giving me like no time to use the bird, basically? I feel like I want to, but I've just been going for grabs and balling. Why you got a ball so hard? There we go. The bird's the MVP again. Real talk. Ooh, it's over. <laughs> I let my guard down because I was focusing on using the bird. I think, um, just kind of formulating my opinion of Nakaruru, I think I thought she was too good or something, like really good because of her special moves. I did not account for how weak her heavy slash moves are. 
Those do not do a lot of damage. So it's like almost like a Sheik situation where like she has to like get like a lot of hits. Um, with good mobility. Sheik, Zero Suit Samus. I think Smash Bros is the best fighting game series for those kind of characters. Um, and probably I'll say Guilty Gear is a close second, but controversial opinion because some people are like Smash Bros is XYZ like I don't care dude like platform fighters are just a type of fighting game so most people I feel can agree with that should be able to agree with that um but yeah <laughs> I didn't know that was coming, like, I had a weird moment of, like, almost knowing it was coming. Oh my god, he's using the kicks in the air, it's like, dude, can you just die already? It's been my whole energy for today. Put this meme together earlier with the... One of my fa my favorite um, quote from a presidential uh, presidential election debate. Um, will you just shut up, man? <laughs> I'm not even gonna say who it was. You guys can you guys can go look that up. That's a fun one to see. Yeah, because like, I'm not going to talk about politics a lot. Obviously, not very fitting for this, um, for this genre. <laughs> but um, I do like watching the debates, that's all I'm going to say. And that's about all I like. All right, now I'll leave it at that. <laughs> no, like I'm done with flashing health, so. Mmm, get fucked. Apparently the crouching heavy slash leaves you vulnerable even on hit. Very strange. Could be wrong. Maybe I wasn't holding block or... I don't know. I'm, I'm lost in a Ganon frenzy because... This is a reminder because I, I think this was over here earlier or something, but like it's level 8. Um... I don't even remember if the camera was on the right or whatever. I like having it in the middle, and it's gonna look really cool because I'm gonna put my other. Um, I have three. I have three of these. The, this is two of them. One, two. Then I have a third one. I'm gonna put right here. So, um, to the point is like, cause I'm in the middle, so it's like symmetrical. Like, I think I think that's cool. I do think that is pretty cool because I like my paper meditations a lot. That's what they're called. Shout out paper meditations. Also, I have not been paying attention at all until right now. So that was my autopilot fighting game gameplay. <laughs> um, there have been so many times like I'm playing um, like an online fighting game and. Um, I'm playing against somebody, and it's like they're good, like they're seriously pretty good, and I'm just like completely spaced out or tuned out, and like I've won like an entire round. It's like I literally like was not present for that, but like I still um, pressed like a, a really good button combination. Like it's just so weird to me. But um, welcome to having a human brain. <laughs> 
basically just one of those moments. Having a human brain and consuming crazy amounts of media. <laughs> Not what you thought I was going to say. But that is what I said. And this was anybody out there who knows my sense of humor pretty good. Maybe then you could have predicted that. Also, screw you, mate. Oh my god. That was the worst time to have an input error. I couldn't tell if I missed the quarter circle or if she put out a kick move. I, I, I slipped and press R1. This fight will be over after two more rounds. As long as I don't get grabbed, then I will lose hope. So stay away, dude. Yeah, keep your balls to yourself. I got crossed up. <sighs> I already said that move was janky. I'm not even gonna not even gonna acknowledge what just happened there beyond this acknowledgement. Okay. sure this is a L. An L. An massive L, just like my webcam freezing. At least you guys can still hear me. Uh, Earth to webcam. about to press deactivate. I did it anyway, for fun. <laughs> okay. How to defeat Ganon. Wow. At least I got something. Good positioning. Good use of the positioning. Just walk towards me mindlessly. And I can't do that. Oh, you should have just killed me, dude. Just put me out of my misery. <laughs> Oh, 
But no, this is. I think Nakaru is a pretty technical character. I, I don't think um, I will be able to get as much of a grasp on her as other characters. And the being rusty part doesn't help, like I said. <laughs> But with getting rusty, often comes the de-rusting later on. De-rustification, maybe. If that's even a word. Slash. I'm gonna start throwing out special moves. I mean, like, that's what the bot does. Must be the optimal strategy. You guys remember. Anybody who's seen it. Knock River throwing out the uh, Hokkaido Hurricanes, as they're called. Lots of Hokkaido Hurricanes, not a lot of Hawks and Heavy Slashes. I think that thing's a Hawk. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> that was a really good exchange. Like the crouching medium slash, that's really funny looking. Should've known. Jumps in to get a grab, just gotta do that. Sometimes clashes can happen, like, even if one person doesn't press an attack input. I, I have no idea how that would happen, but like, it seems like it does. I don't know. Could be wrong. Oh, okay. The times where it is actually good to get an input error. the exact wrong moment to jump backwards. <laughs> Not a trade in my favor. Not a big surprise. Pretty brutal. I think 
we had a bunch of these before, right? Yeah, we'll put we'll put one up. We need some good luck around here. Top right. It's a good choice. Alright. Alright, man. Your attempts to guard my weapon failed. to punish um I'm gonna start punishing with her Hokkaido Hurricane that'll be most optimal Got me beat on the range just like so badly. I feel that is why I'm struggling. Not sure how accurate that is, but. Definitely need to start jumping after that every time because that's really good. And that is really not good. Not gonna stop till I beat this guy. It might take another three hours. That is obviously in the realm of possibilities. Though I do not think it will take me really that long. Yeah, I really like that actually. The janky move is now one of my favorites. Not surprising. <laughs> four times in a row perfectly. Get wrecked, boy. Oh. Can't play the zoning game. Cannot do that. because he moved so far forward. That was close. situation. Too 
That was going so well until the last round. Just a slaughter. Fitting for the guy with the slaughterhouse. The stage looks like a slaughterhouse. Or like, what even is going on here? <laughs> yeah. If Ganon um, was released in 2022, they would say, this character is not the vibe. I feel that is true. But this will be a video released in 2022 with him in it, so maybe this video is the same, suffers the same fate as Ganon. <laughs> Wow moment. Well, it gets. Uh, oh my god. Starting over that sentence. It starts to get hot around here in May. Uh, Today's May 2nd, it's like this rain today were the first couple of really hot days this year at this new location located along the Atlantic Ocean. Not like I live on the beach, but like 10 minute drive away. I was just there today, it was nice. Pretty windy though. Always makes it a little bit unpleasant. If it's too windy. I like the non's heavy slash. I'm pretty jealous right now. As a person playing his knock over room. Of course that grab happened. Oh 
Okay. I feel like this fight is almost over. That backfired really badly. It's okay though. Yeah, like, I'm so distracted. I don't even know if I said this or just thought about saying it, but, um, I don't think I did. Uh, the Hokkaido Hurricane attacks, I do not know how to use them. Like, for such a simple move. Really, I'm at a loss, honestly. Air, I guess, but like, and grounded ones for punishing, but like, both of those I'm not even sure about, like, it's weird. I'm more sure about the anti-air idea, but I just like the bird. Can't win with just that, not as easily. Alright, just stay away from me, man. Just, just don't. Do not engage. Wow, that kind of scared me. <laughs> I thought, I thought he got me when I was jumping. That, that, I think that was close. I think he almost had me at the end, but nah. <sighs> yeah, I need to eat some food. I'm like, that was pretty draining. Hark. The voice of nature. I, I don't know what that was supposed to mean. Call me Amakusa. Amakusa. The dark guy. Me? Hehe. <laughs> My lord thirsts for your strength in his lowly little love nest. Never corpse breath. Then die, you crazy funster. I said never. Yeah, damn right. You better hear me, Amakusa. Or as you apparently re refer as you apparently prefer to be referred to as Amakusa Amakusa. Mic drop. Yeah, but um, that's going to be it for this episode. I'm going to eat some food. Maybe record more tonight. It's not tomorrow, so. Yeah, that was the beginning of the end. The beginning of Nakaruru's run through this game. So drop a like if you liked it. <laughs> and catch you on the next one.